In this video I'm showing you the recipe for this crispy fried cauliflower. The cauliflower has a super crispy batter that tastes really good with lots of spices. And yeah, I really like having this as a snack. I just dip the pieces in my favorite dipping sauce. Start by cutting your cauliflower into florets that are all roughly the same size so that they will cook evenly. Then boil the cauliflower for three to four minutes in salted water. So we're only boiling them for three to four minutes, which means that they won't be completely cooked yet. They will be like half cooked. And that is exactly what we want since we're going to fry them later on. While the cauliflower is cooking, we can mix up the petals. So the first one is a flour mixture. So we're going to add all-purpose flour, salt and pepper. Mix this up. And for the red petal, you want to mix flour, cornstarch, onion powder, garlic powder, paprika powder, oregano, cayenne pepper, cumin, and soy milk. And then mix to combine. So halfway through I switched to mixing with a whisk. Since there are some lumps and mixing it like this is way easier. So just start with a whisk at the beginning. <laughs> and mix until you get this consistency. So it's quite thick, but still liquid. Then heat up some oil. And while the oil is heating up, you want to toss the cooked cauliflower in the flour mixture. Then dip them in the batter. And then fry them. So just a tip on how you can see if the oil is hot enough if you don't own a thermometer. You can add a wooden spoon in and if bubbles start to form around it like you can see here that means that the oil is hot enough and you can start frying your cauliflower. Fry these for about 5 minutes until golden brown and crispy and when they're done take them out of the oil and let them leak out on a bit of kitchen paper towel. And then they are done. I hope you really enjoyed this recipe. And if you have any questions, let me know in the comments below. 